Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Android Shop App Development Tutorial. Today I'm going to start with the Android Shop layout design. This is our Shop dashboard design, and we are going to implement this in the uh, Shop activity. So in the previous episode, we have created the Shop activity, and we will implement the design in this layout so let's start adding the dependency file in our build gradle file so i am going to start with the file project structure and in the module app dependencies and library dependency so choose the card view here and press ok and just wait for the project synchronization all right our project synchronization is complete and I'm going to start with the string resources file so uh, inside the resources let's choose the string and add some necessary string uh, which are popular products and value is popular products and another one is string name equals to browse category and browse category Android resources directory and choose the anim and press ok so inside anim I'm going to add anim resource file that is fed in so here I'm going to add the uh, Android interpolator equals to at the rate Android anim a linear interpolator and inside the set I am using alpha fed in value from alpha 0 0.1 and in 2 alpha let's say to 1.0 and set the duration to fifteen hundred. Okay, so we have a heading effect here. So let's create and we are fade out. Animation and paste the file from padding and just change from alpha and to alpha slightly opposite. Okay, we have an animation which will which we will implement in the uh, image banner. So let's go to the activity sub and I'm going to use here linear layout okay so here I'm going to use the view flavor uh, match parent and for the layout height I want to use a 220 dp which is fixed and 
uh, let's give an id that is id img banner for the moment i am going to uh, use the code for the banner so we can see the preview this will be a static banner uh, just uh, decrease the height to 200 dp okay all right uh, so let's go to the design and copy paste all of the banner file to our drivable resources file folder okay so we have banner one two three three files and let's go to the sub activity java declare a variable view clipper img banner and here i'm going to uh, get the resources of banner so img banner equals to find view by id r dot id dot img banner uh, let's create another variable integer uh, slider array type so we have a three image uh, they are r dot drawable dot banner one next one is r dot drawable dot banner two and r dot drawable dot banner three and terminate here now i am going to create another function for the animation so public void banner flipper and have integer image so image view image view equals to new image view that is this and image view dot set image resources image img banner dot set uh, sorry add view image view uh, so img banner dot set flip interval uh, so 6000 millisecond img banner dot set auto star to true img banner dot set in animation this and and dot dot and in dot fade in so uh, there is some error that means it's not set in animation so i am going to add set in animation so i am the banner dot set out animation this android 
dot r dot anim dot fade out okay so let's use the banner prepare to our sliders so for integer slide sliders as slide banner flipper slide okay uh, I have completed the banner model here okay uh, let me run it in the emulator and check the preview so the app is uh, running here so here you can see the preview the image is going to fade in and fade out uh, in uh, 6000 millisecond and it seems uh, quite good so that's all for today in the next episode we'll use the uh, uh, popular product horizontal scroll view uh, where we will fetch the data from the uh, firebase database and so in the horizontal scroll view uh, that's all for today so we'll see in the next episode thank you guys thank you for seeing me have a nice day